everybody, this is Praxis and I'm back on site today for just a couple of hours. It's been kind of a crazy day today back at home, but I really wanted to make at least a little bit of headway here, and a little bit is a good way of describing what I've been able to accomplish today. I've been here for just about two hours. Uh, you can see uh, in here, uh, River and Amber came with me today. River's been playing outside and Amber's been uh, here to be a companion to him so that I could make it over here today. Uh, what I started off on when I got here is, uh, you guys might recall, yesterday I was working on the uh, air vents that go from the top floor all the way down to the bottom. That's completely done and it's running right now. I don't know if you can hear it, it's really subtle and it's bringing air from the top all the way over here. It comes out of this uh, vent area right here and what's great over here is I can smell a real musty smell which means it's working because I'm sure that all these tunnels under here made out of the cinder blocks and everything are damp and I want to start moving air through it. And what's even better is that that musty smell, it's all over this area, which means that we're taking the air from the top, bring it down here, and it is slowly filling the space, which is going to be great when that isn't musty air, but deliciously cool air in the summer when it's really hot and we want to get this nice cool air from under the slab, fill in this area. In the winter time, when we have the fire going and it's you know, warm air up at the top, coming under here, it's gonna you know, circulate all this nice warm air. It's just working really beautiful, uh, beautifully. It was really like a Hail Mary, that, the way that I put it together. I would read one book about it once. I'm familiar with the Roman bath system about how they ran air under their floors and stuff. But beyond that, it was just me kind of being, you know, let's cross our fingers and hope that this isn't a huge waste of time. And it's not. It's working really, really, really well. I'm really pleased with that. Um, anyway, point is, what I did today is I ran a little electrical wire from down here, goes all the way up to the top, so that when I flip a switch to turn on the fan here, if I want, I could have another booster fan up at the top. I don't think I'm ever going to need it, but the easiest time to run a wire from here to the top is now before there's anything there. So I ran a wire up. I could also install a dehumidifier. You know, if the air up top is really humid and I want to dry it out before it goes down or, uh, you know, some kind of a dust filter or anything that I want to install, it gives me the option to have a box up there that you can flip a switch here and it turns, the, uh, you know, the devices on at both ends. Other than running that one wire, I've just been taking the tape, the masking tape, and moving it from those uh, ceiling joists to these ceiling joists. You can see one of them's all taped in in blue already here. I'm working on this guy, and I'm not going to have any time to stain these things because uh, we've got to get out of here, and it, it would probably take a half an hour just to do that guy, and then I have to wait for 15 minutes uh, to do the wipe down later. So that's going to be the first thing I do tomorrow, and I'll share it with you tomorrow when I see you again. That's it. Thanks for watching.